get high. Let me connect my Arduino to this and then have a look at whether it works as expected doing. So I'm perfectly connecting it here. And I'll show you some more steps like which you need to follow along uh, to get this thing being done. So done connecting here and you can see this, uh, it's turned on here and it's time that we go ahead and check that out. So first thing first, go to the, uh, go to your tools here and you can see this in the board. First thing you have to do is select the board. So by default, Arduino Uno is selected. So I know Uno is fine here, Uno, right? And then next thing is to select the pin number. So pin number four, that is a uh, port com for Arduino Uno, right? So just in case if you do not get it from here, what you can do is you can go to the device manager and from the device manager, you can check out like uh, which uh, USB, I mean like which COM port has your thing. So if I go back here, see this, I have multiple COM ports, right? So what I have to do is COM ports here and then Arduino is connected here, right? Wait a minute, COM4, so you can get it from here too. Just in case if it doesn't show you COM4 here, Arduino Uno, then if you're not sure and only shows you COM4, you can go back and check it from there when that works fine. So that's selected with this, good enough. Let me now upload this. So the first button what we had was for verify that is to compile the code. That is to check if there are any errors or not. Next one is to upload the code, okay? So let me click on that, upload the code, and I'll show you here what's happening. So let me just uh, give you, give me a second. I'll just try to show you this. So I am trying to upload this. Let me open my camera. So currently we have this thing. Uh, it's uh, perfectly fine. You can just have a look at this. All right. Now I'll upload this code. So let me upload the code here. Not save this. I'm uploading the code. All fine. And uh, you should be seeing this buttons, this lights glowing here, this two lights glowing here, when the upload is happening. Okay. So not it. We gotta come back here. Yeah, now it's uploading. So you see this, this two lights were glowing, right? This like RX and T. This upload is happening. Fine. The upload is happening, and uh, LED is not connected to the pin number ten. Let me connect an LED to the pin number ten out here. So pin number 10 is this one here. I can see this tip pin number 10 is here and the ground is pin is here. So let me connect them together. So you see this, this close, fine. It's turning on. Now with it, as simple as that. For example, all I have to do is this one. Now this going fine. You see this, this going fine. And now it will not turn off because I've only made it to turn high. Let me just do is like I'll make it off. So I'll I'll keep it on for some time. So I'll do, use the keyword called syntax called delay. And delay, okay. And then I'll give some time. That is 1000 milliseconds. That is one second, okay. So 1000 is the milliseconds, all right. And then again, I'll tell digital right. Digital right. And I'll tell, make the pin number 10 low. Pin number 10 low. Close this. Now, uh, so I'll upload this again quickly out here. And I'll save this again. I'll quickly upload this and see what happens. So that is, it is not giving any change. The reason why it is not giving any change is because, uh, can you tell me what is the reason? Because it's turning, it is high for one second and it is off for, like just off and then on. So it's repeating, right? Continuously repeating. So here I've given one, one second delay, but here I've not given any delay, right? So it is on and it goes off quickly and then on again within fractions of milliseconds. So you don't even get to know it. So let me add a delay here also in the, this line so that you are able to make a difference. So now there should be some difference. So it's going to, I will press control plus you to upload it. So it is going to upload it now and let us just see the difference now. So now it should on for one second and off for one second. And you know how exactly to write down that, right? So see so this now off on very simple as that oh we're pretty much clear with this yes so this is how uh, simple the syntax is the way it works and everything we have into it so if you have multiple different lines to write here all i have to do is just copy them paste them copy them and paste them and it's going to all work fine. For example, in our case, seven pin pin number seven is also there, right? I'll paste it here. 
and just change this pin number to seven. Make it to pin number seven and make it to pin number seven. Or I can give any other sequence also. Instead of high, you can also give one. Instead of blue, I can also give zero. High, I can give one. Instead of blue, I can also give zero. Even this should work perfectly fine because one and high both are the same. And one and zero, zero and low are both, both are the same. So uploading it back again here, and so this, the syntax is all the same up there. Okay, pin number seven is not connected to this one now, so you're not able to see the pin number seven right here. But yeah, it's fine, right? You get to have it done. This light is glowing here. This this light is glowing here. That's a default in build five. We have it, so that works as expected. So all fine here. So we have this uh, clear. We uh, very simple steps. So by now, I hope like we are pretty much clear with the. Uh, the how to install an Arduino ID, set up the whole thing out there, the way, the whole UI of an Arduino ID, and the way we can go ahead and proceed with the uh, the sketch of an Arduino, what are the things we have into it, how can we go ahead and write down that.